What's going on you guys? Welcome back to another episode here of Outdoor Sensei. My name is Jamoy and today we're here on this uh, river. Try to see if we can get some ducks. We got like three minutes left until shooting light. If you guys haven't yet, make sure you guys head down there, hit that subscribe button, hit that thumbs up. And hopefully we can get onto some birds today. <music> Got one. Got one. Yeah, let's go. Looks like a Drake Mallard. Alright you guys, so quick update here, it's about 9 o'clock right now, the flight's been pretty good today, it's just shooting's not, but so far we got one Drake Mallard, beautiful bird, but let's see if we can get some more bird, so stay tuned you guys. You see that? Oh. They're coming right over you. Take it. I got one. I'm gonna go pick up. Looks like a gadwall. Beautiful bird. Watch 
check that out, you guys. Oh, this wind. Huh? I did. Gadwall. Shells. Oh. Shooting number fours today. So. Check that out, you guys. Beautiful bird. All right, you guys, so update. Yeah, one gadwall, Drake. So, still a little bird, some bird flying. Should have picked up a couple out of that group, but, you know, I'm not the best shooter, so. But so far, pretty good. We got a really nice wind. Wind is behind our back, so we've been seeing all the birds flying in front of us. All right, you guys, so I just got home. Uh, we're gonna start cleaning up the duck right now, so don't mind the background. My garage is a mess right now. I got like all my hunting stuff over there, and there's like grass all over my garage, like blind grass, and you know, my wife hates it. But we'll clean that next time. We're gonna clean the ducks right now. Still, us, still, I'll leave it. She was picking at it, but sadly, I cannot take her out today. I have not trained Stella to be on the kayak yet, so. Hopefully we can do that next season, but tomorrow morning I am taking her. We're just gonna go uh, jump shoot some ponds and we'll see what happened there. So yeah, let's clean these ducks. All right, you guys, so right here is the duck. Hey, go away. Right here is, this is the mallard. This is the gaddy right here. Beautiful, beautiful duck, man. So I don't know what I'm doing yet. I think I'm just gonna start plucking. Um, I'll show you guys the final results. Um, I, I do have a torch here, so I am gonna torch like the down feather. So we'll see how it goes. Uh, once again, yeah, I'll show you guys once I'm all done. All right, you guys, so I just got done uh, cleaning the ducks. It looks, pretty, it looks pretty dirty right now, but this is the mallard right here. This right here is the gadwall. So you can kind of see the color difference. This is a lot darker and a lot more fat on this one too, on the gadwall. But what I did was I, I plucked the breast and then I torched it. Cause this is a lot of down feathers. So I'm gonna show you guys how I'm gonna clean all these little uh, small little burnt here. So I'm just gonna turn the water semi-warm. And then you just want to rinse it, clean it, and then you want to take a sharp knife, just like so, and then just run your knife on the skin. Kind of like you're shaving it off. So as you guys can see, it's a, it's a little cleaner now. So you guys can see that all these dark spots right here. Take your knife, run it through, or I mean, run it against the skin. You do want to make sure your knife is sharp when you do this, because it'll clean it better.
So this way you don't get that burnt taste when you're eating it. I don't know if I did a good job pressing it. This is my first time pressing it. But yeah, there you go. Nice and clean. All right, so right here is what we're left with. Yeah, that, that breast on the left, nah, it don't look too good. But this is the Gadawa. And then this over here is the Mallard. I think I did a pretty good job. Decent, decent. All right, you guys, so right here I have the Mallard breasts, uh, the Gadwall ones. Um, I put it in the vacuum seal and it's in the freezer now. So I'm going to season these. Uh, my plan is to just pan sear them. Uh, I'm gonna add black pepper. And then I have a little garlic powder here. Hopefully this is good. I've never done this before. And then we have some salt. This is pretty much how I do my steak. Press it on there. Hit it with the salt. Some black pepper. Garlic powder. And then I'm just gonna let it sit. Wow, I, Stella is making a bunch of noise right behind me. So I'm gonna, I am on a keto diet. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut these bacon into small pieces. And then I'm gonna cook the bacon with the Brussels sprouts. And then I'm gonna use the leftover oil to pan fry this. All right, so I am going to cook all these wonderful bacon right here. This is gonna give us a lot of good uh, bacon grease. So I'm gonna cook this down until they're fully cooked. Once they're fully cooked, then I'm gonna add my Brussels sprouts right here. All right, so this bacon is just about ready. It's not that crispy yet, but we're still gonna cook it with the Brussels sprouts, so it'll crisp up. But you guys see all this oil in here? So what I'm gonna do, is I am going to put that oil into a different pan. And this is where I'm going to cook my duck. Add my Brussels sprouts in here. All right, you guys, so I did feel like there was too much bacon grease, so I did pour quite a bit of it out. So here we go, we're gonna do skin side down.
Try to crisp, crisp that skin. I got the heat at medium. I'm gonna turn it down just a tier. Oh, this is gonna be good, you guys. Alright you guys, we are going to go in for the flip. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Try to get a nice medium rear here. Our duck breast is ready. I hope it's like a medium rear. Check that out. Yeah, let it sit on this towel. Let it rest for like 10 minutes. And there you go, you guys. That is the final product right there. This is going to be delicious. So yeah, let's give it a taste test. All right, you guys, so we are going to cut into the breast. Let's see what we got. Hopefully it's nice and pink. And medium rear is what we're looking for. And that looks pretty damn good you guys all right I gotta I gotta taste this we got pizza on the side for the family here you go mmm that's very really good it's not Gave me at all. That skin is really good. I'm gonna you guys a better look here. Look at that, you guys. Mmm. <clears throat> that is really good. So if you guys haven't tried this yet, cook it in bacon grease, give it a shot. If you guys like this video, hit that thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you guys next time.